So in the last video I talked about symbol maps and in this video I am going to talk about the field maps which is also very similar to the symbol maps. The only thing is it is completely filled as the name suggests and down there it is mentioned that it requires one geo dimension and uh, zero or more dimension and zero or one mesh. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, replicate our work that we did in the last uh, video. So here is the state and here is the sales. That's pretty much all what we need to create this chart. And then click here and here we have the sales information and uh, the color coding basically indicated by this range which is saying it is starting from 920 and it is going up till 457,000. So basically darker the color is that means more the sales. So here in this case California is having more sales followed by New York and I think then Texas and then Washington so on and so forth. And uh, that's that's basically how easy it is that you just select uh, one one geo dimension whatever it may be state city or country and then uh, the one measure and uh, you have the chart displayed for you uh, within the tableau. The next thing uh, we may want to do is uh, let's say we want sum of sales. Uh, we don't want sum of sales as a uh, measure. Suppose that we figured out uh, sum of sales is not what our requirement and maybe the profit is what we want to show. So you can basically remove this and uh, get profit over here as part of color and then you can show the profit if you want to show the labels you can again put the profit on labels and it will show you the profit but uh, let's say on labels you want to say the say you want to see the sales as a labels then move this and put label sales on the label so now what you are able to see is basically this is the sales based on the sales where you have the maximum profit. So it's basically the two information that you that you are able to see and uh, your user will be able to have a much better idea that even though sales is large or small, uh, what is the level of profit. So here in this case, uh, Texas is basically the uh, third largest uh, sales territory for the company but it is not a profitable one so something to really look upon what uh, management wants to do over here so that's how uh, very easy and very quick it is to to basically go ahead and uh, you know create the field maps um, you can play around with this based on the needs the measure and dimension that you have and uh, it will it will going to display very quickly for you so that's that's a easy and quick way to create field maps and that's pretty much all I wanted to discuss in this video and I'll meet you in the new video, the new topic.